Let's take some live images right now. That is ISB in Williamson Boulevard, right in front of the Daytona International Speedway. In a little more than a week, tens of thousands of race fans will be right there for the Coke Zero Sugar 400. And the Speedway says, well, they want to make it feel like a pre-pandemic race. But as Fox 35's Jessica Ely reports, the track president is tracking the surge in COVID cases. NASCAR returns to Daytona International Speedway next weekend for the sports regular season finale. And for the first time since early last year, the stands will be open to full capacity. <laughs> Speedway crews are preparing. We're just so grateful that we get to welcome our fans back. Our midway is going to be packed. The Speedway will open to full capacity for the Coke Zero Sugar 400 and the Wawa 250. On a daily basis, we're in touch with local and state health officials um, and we'll absolutely keep our fans and safety our number one priority. Masks aren't required outside or in the grandstands, but fans will have to mask up when inside a suite or on club level. Our fan safety and, and the health of our fans, you know, that's our number one priority. The Speedway has a weekend full of activities planned, including two concerts, a fully open fan zone, and a Saturday morning tailgate party. Such a game changer for our fans to be able to come out and know that it's the the Daytona that they that they expect to experience. So far, DIS says it's already surpassed the number of tickets sold in 2019 for the same event. You can find out how to buy tickets on our website, fox35orlando.com. Reporting from Daytona International Speedway, Jessica Ely, Fox 35 News.